I just heard a nasty V8 just pull up. It sounded American. Let's go check it out. Everybody else is too busy working. Oh no, it's cool. It's cool, Josh. You just park it wherever you want. No one's gonna tell you to move it, it's fine. For those who don't know, this is Josh Barnett, AKA the War Master. Babyface assassin. At one point, when I was younger and dumber, with less scars and less gray hairs. So tell us about what you brought today. Uh, I just brought my, my Mustang, man. It's my Mustang. body style. It's a GT500. Let's see what you got underneath the sheets. We swapped out the supercharger that comes with it for a 2.9 liter Whipple. I think it makes 700 to the rear wheels. 700 to the rear wheels. 700 to the rear wheels. And you got a dyno sheet. I do. I actually take my car in to get it tuned to make sure it doesn't explode. The first person here to come in with a dyno sheet. Bigger intercooler reservoir, bigger heat exchanger, uh, CSF gave us this, this great aluminum radiator. This car is made to do whatever. It's a it's a, a hit the track in any kind of way car with stuff that you can just bolt on. You know? I like how you actually drive it, so it's not like immaculate. It's like no, I mean a lot Driven of this car. like crap is from like tearing up Turnbull Canyon or <laughs> whatever else. I'm in a responsible way. Yeah, oh, Spir spirited yes. driving. Spirited. Well, I'm always running Toyota tires, running Proxus R triple eights, stickiest thing that I could pretty much find for the street on HRE monoblock one-piece wheels because I was just thinking about trying to take weight off of this car as much as possible. The car weighs, I think stock, they're like 3,800. And I think with me in it now, it's like 3,800 something. I mean, what you got for suspension? All the pieces underneath there are uh, from BMR fabrication. The stuff has been fantastic for this car from the light and K-member to the tubular A-arms, the upper control arms in the rear too. And it's got a multi-point subframe connector that attaches to multiple points underneath the body to really give it a lot of rigidity. For shocks, I'm running uh, KW Club Sport coilovers. Yeah. I yanked the uh, motorized seats and put these Recaros in. Uh, more weight saving, plus these things are going to hold you in place a lot better. Ride Tech supplied me with this thing called the Tiger Cage here, which is a, a really fantastic setup. And like I said, bolt in, this is not a custom fabricated deal. This is made for this car. It's also got door bars that go with it, but I haven't yeah. installed them. Uh, Magnaflow, yes. Rocking some old stuff. I have a destroyer sticker on my daily driver too. I represent. <laughs> when this car, I had it built to compete in the Optima Ultimate Street Car Invitational. And of course, I'm way overmatched, not only in wheel skills, but also in car budget and build. But I wanted to go out there with something that wasn't custom from the ground up, that people watching this could never potentially own or build or have themselves, but actually have something that could go out there and rip and haul ass and do it time and time again and be dependable. That really means Josh is building a car that's not unobtainable. Yeah. That's really what it is. There is no unobtainium in this car. I promise you. The hardest thing in the car is the driver. Uh, it's running a one-piece aluminum drive shaft because honestly these F197s with their multi-link like, trunnion thing that they got underneath there, I know that stock-wise it, it, it can be just fine. Mm -hmm. I just don't feel safe with it, especially when you start putting power to it and wanting to hammer on it. I even did this to my mom's Mustang. We put a one-piece drive shaft in that. Your mom's got a Mustang? My mom's got an 07 GT California Special that I put together for her that's uh, running on Eibach Pro Kit with a Whipple supercharger, makes 475, run a Magnaflow exhaust. <laughs> My mom loves it. It's got 275s all the way around on it. What? Yeah. Your mom ripping in that thing or what? Uh, I mean, if she needs to, I, mean, I want to make sure she's good to go. We all know what happens. When you park the car up on the dock, you gotta do a Bernie. I gotta so. add to this. I gotta this patina. This is starting to become something of legend here. You guys like the tires? Oh yeah. Nice, let's go. Control down like I don't have that anymore. Oh, it's all disabled. Yeah, that was sick. Good tires. Just like.
like at the drag strip. The juice. The chlorine. The juice. Josh for coming by, dude. Oh, is that, that a fist bump? Is a, fitty, yeah. is a shitty high five fist bumping <laughs> weird thing. The love is real. He the has love is real. Too good of tires to do this. Too good of tires, too sticky, but that's that's all it, that's alright. They needed to be warmed up anyways. <laughs>